we're going to find the nth term of this geometric sequence using the formula a times r to the power of n minus 1. So in this sequence, a is the first term and r is the common ratio, which is the multiplying factor. It's different to an arithmetic sequence because instead of adding from one term to another, we're going to multiply by the common ratio. So the first term is 2, so a equals 2, and 2 times 3 is 6, and 6 times 3 is 18, so the common ratio is 3. So this we have term is 2 times 3 to the power of n minus 1. And we can check that with n equals 3, so a third term in the sequence. That would be 2 multiplied by 3 to the power of 3 to the equal 1, so it's 3 squared. 2 times 3 squared is 18. So the next sequence, a is the first term again, 256. And r is, this time we're dividing by 4. So the common ratio would be 1 quarter. So we're finding 1 quarter of the next term. So it's 256 multiplied by 1 quarter to a power of n minus 1. And the last sequence. The first term is 1, so a equals 1. And the common ratio, the multiplying factor, is negative 2. So the sequence becomes a, which is 1, times 2 to a power, negative 2 to the power of n minus 1.